patient is a known case of diabetes, type 2 diabetes mellitus, which is uncontrolled and does not maintain proper oral hygiene. He has no history of habits and we have to frame the PATH protocol for this case. So first, we have to predict, identify the risk factors that the patient is having. Now, in a medical history, we, we see that the patient has type 2 diabetes mellitus, which is uncontrolled. Now, what is the common, or the most common oral manifestation of diabetes? Periodontal disorders, obviously. Then, dental history and personal history, patient does not give any particular history about it. Family history, the patient's parents are diabetic, which gives a genetic predisposition about the patient. So, after the analysis of the predict, predicting phase, we come upon to the prediction that if left untreated, the patient is at a high risk for periodontal destruction, mobile tooth, tooth loss, and potential systemic complications. Next, the assess phase. Now, what do we do in the assess phase? We go about the clinical history, we examine the patient, and we basically use the four principles of examination, inspection, palpation, percussion, and auscultation, and also radiographic investigation. So upon doing that, in this case, we find that it's under soft tissue findings, the patient has chronic generalized gingivitis, and there are generalized periodontal pockets present. Upon heart tissue findings, there are mobility with respect to 35237, 45247, 2627, which is of grade 1. And then